Hey everyone, so I've gotten quite a few comments and questions in specifically one of my videos, the owl video that I did, the drawing about the techniques and uh, the tools I use to do that technique. So I thought I would make a video kind of explaining a little bit about it and uh, where I picked it up. But uh, so first off, I uh, actually found this technique on YouTube by uh, a YouTuber, another artist. Uh, his name is, I believe, Lisandro Pena. Super, super talented. Unbelievable his, his detail that he does with this technique and just his detail in general is just unbelievable. But uh, I'll put a link in the description to uh, some of his tutorials he does for this technique because that's how I learned it and, and figured out how to do it. They're super helpful and very informative so I'll, I'll link him down in the description and definitely check him out. So yeah, so this technique, I don't really know if it has a name to it, but I just call it the scratching technique because that's basically what you're doing. You're using a relatively sharp tool to scratch the surface of the paper leaving indents. Those indents will uh, not pick up the, the graphite or charcoal that you're using. So when you draw over it, all of the high spots will pick up the charcoal, be dark, and all of the low spots, all the indents, will stay pretty much white, leaving what looks like hairs. And that's basically the, the basics of this technique, the short, easy description of it. Um, some of the tools I use, so mine are, I don't know if there's specific ones for it, but mine are just kind of makeshift. So this is just a empty pen cartridge, took out all of the insides, and I hot glued a nail to the inside um, so it wouldn't wiggle around or anything. After I hot glued it, I took sandpaper and sanded the tip of it so it's a little bit smoother, not so sharp and pointy, so it wouldn't leave such fine, fine indents, it's a little bit wider, leaving a little bit thicker of hairs. I used this one for the majority of this piece. And then I just wrapped some uh, cotton balls with some uh, painter's tape to make it a little bit wider, fits a little bit better in my hand. Um, another one I have, same thing, but this one is uh, more sharp so it's pointier thinner thinner tip so you can use it to do finer hairs uh, which I use to do kind of the in-betweens of the of the pads on the paws and then I have another one here which is a lot thicker to do thicker hairs like maybe whiskers or something or if you're doing a much larger drawing than just other hairs. But a super basic short uh, description or, or short kind of tutorial explaining how this works is you're just using the, the tip to indent the paper. So you have to press quite hard but you're just trying to indent the paper and then those leave hairs and all that. But I would definitely recommend you check out the tutorial. I'm not the best person to really teach you guys this. This is only really my second time using this technique. So I would definitely check out uh, Lisandro's channel uh, and his tutorials. He's like, I would say a master at it, but uh, yeah. And uh, if you guys have any more questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section. I'll try to get to them and answer them the best I can. But uh, hopefully this answered some of your guys' questions. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a good one.